Hi friends, Amy Love here and I'm coming on today to share with you um, this little creation that I created on uh, a live with Kim on Kim's channel. If you didn't uh, get a chance to check that out, there's a link to Kim's channel below. And I decided that I was going to start checking stuff off of one of my Pinterest boards because I keep pinning, but I hardly ever <laughs> create the things that inspired me to pin it in the first place. So. I had these floating pockets on my Instagram uh, board for junk journals, and I was like, let's do this. So I thought uh, Kim's laces would make a great floating pocket, along with these beautiful digitals from my friend Marie at Cupcakes um, Pearls and Lace. And I'm using her shabby vignette journal kit, and there may be some pieces from the shabby add-on kit, I'm not sure. But I will put a link to Marie's Etsy below, and also to her YouTube channel, because there's inspiring things going on over there. So I used this beautiful lace from Kim's shop to make the pocket. I just sewed it down onto some scrap paper that I had so that the back would be pretty too since it's going to be floating around. And um, that made a really great pocket because it's so wide. But the thing about it, since I backed it with this paper, and I think I double layered it so it's really sturdy, but there's not a lot of give. Um, if I would have used like a stretchy lace, that would have given me a bigger pocket. So I couldn't fit everything in the pocket. So these little file folder notebooks that I made using the little file folders in Marie's kit, I just couldn't get them in there too. So <laughs> it's just like a side. In addition to the floating pocket, there's a little tiny notebook, which is super cute. So um, on top of this fabric pocket I used this beautiful lace from Kim's store I am loving snipping this lace up because it has the hearts and then it has this too oh my goodness excuse me my cat decided to come up and get some cuddles right before I filmed and unfortunately I'm allergic to him but that does not keep me from giving him proper cuddles <laughs> so my allergies are a little um excited right now so I cut a piece off of that and that's what this bottom piece is right there oh, I just love it and then I put one of the shabby flowers from Kim's store a bling piece from Kim's store this is um, a stick pin that I created uh, using pieces of the stick pin kit uh, from Angel Dream Crafts it's so cute so that's just on there and I did make two of these and they're very similar so I'm really only going to go through the one because they're basically the same just slight variances in color that's it and the digitals are from the same kit but different digitals in each pocket so then I used a bulb pin from Kim's store and I put on one of her pink floating heart charms isn't it so cute and then a little bow so adorable and then inside my goodness Jake you made my nose run inside the pocket is this beautiful tag from the kit and I put um, some of the sari silk on top of all the tags from Kim's shop and then I created a shaker because yes please I love a shaker so it's a little shaker tag um, with a sari silk bow. I did put little uh, rose gold eyelets on all the tags and then I popped up one and popped on one of the sugar hearts from Kim's shop. So stinking cute. But I do want to show you the shaker tag in the other pocket because it's also cute and I'm in love with these. Ah, adorable. Adorable. And I like the bling from Kim's store on here. And I made the bows out of sari silk from Kim's store too. Let me set that one back over to the side before I get confused. So there's those two. And then here's one of the bigger tags that I stickled just because, because look at it. It's beautiful. <laughs> and those things were just like, please stickle me. So I did gorgeousness. And then here's one of the sweet little postcards. Uh, from her kit isn't it so cute and so let me see uh, this came off of this beautiful lace right here 
from Kim's store. And then this little collage I collaged out of this one and some pieces of this one because I am just really loving cutting out these little flowers and using them on my projects. So those are the goodies in this floating pocket. Let's see if I can get it all back in there nice, nicely. <laughs> and I made the bow so big on that, I'm just kind of leaving it hovering above, which I think is cute too. Right. So the pocket is stinking adorable. And then here's the little notebook. So I've got some seam, not seam binding, sorry, silk from Kim's shop and some lace on the side. Another piece from this beautiful lace right there. And then I cut off some more of this for that spot. Oh, and a bulb pin is all mixed up now. Goodness gracious, these things, they don't stay where you want them to. Get in there. So on this bulb pin from Kim's shop, I put on one of her um, enamel bow charms, which is so cute. Let me see if I can get it. I am like butter fingers right now. So cute. And then one of her ribbon roses dangling off right there. And then look at this beautiful file folder, mini file folder from Marie's shop. So cute. And so inside I created a pocket with this lace from Kim. And then I just stuck in some of the beautiful, look at this, beautiful tags from Marie's Digital. And then here's a little ticket. Also, it's just gorgeous. Can you look at how absolutely beautiful. Love those. And then I just put some paper in here. And um, I sewed the paper together and just tied it into the notebook. And then here are two more tags from Marie's Digitals. So cute. I mean, these were so fun to do. I love them, but I do want to show you also the uh, postcard is different in this one. Isn't that sweet? These little leaves here, I cut off of uh, this lace. I just think these make great leaves and those are from Kim's shop. And then that is of course from her pink bridal trim so stinking cute and then here's the one that i stickled over here just beautiful i had so much fun making these little floating pockets and the little extra side notebook <laughs> and i'm looking forward to checking some more stuff off of my pinterest board and giving it a go <laughs> So I'd love to know what you think. Be sure you follow the link below to Angel Dream Crafts on Etsy where I use, got all of the beautiful laces and embellishments. And there's also a link to everyone else on her design team. You should go check them out. They do amazing, beautiful work. And I will also have a link to uh, Marie's Etsy and her YouTube. So I hope you're all doing well. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up, everybody. Bye.